Man, there is nothing like the feel and smell and look of a brand new car, I can tell you right now. But this Tesla Model 3 is not brand new. It's a year old. I've been driving this thing regularly now for a year, but to look around, you would say, man, it's still in brand new condition. I'm gonna show you how to keep it that way. So today's episode, we're gonna be talking about the steering wheel. The steering wheel is a really high point of contact. Even with Tesla's super awesome autopilot, we still gotta have our hands on the wheel and we're, we're, we wanna drive the car too. So a lot of times we'll transfer oils from our hands, hand cream, and man, don't let that hand sanitizer get anywhere near this fake, faux, vegan, pleather, whatever you wanna call it, it's not leather. It just can't take that hand sanitizer. And really, for that matter, we shouldn't get hand sanitizer on anywhere in our vehicle. It's almost all alcohol, and it's almost certain to do damage. So, uh, during the process of transferring stuff to this wheel, what we don't want it to do is embed in the fabric. So we want to do spot cleaning. In between our larger details and our bigger interior cleans, we can do little tiny mini cleanups and make our job a lot easier and make this material last a lot longer. I'm going to show you how to do it right now. My go-to product, PNS Express Interior Cleaner. Man, I like this stuff. It goes on easy. It doesn't leave any residue. Brings it back to brand new and it's really affordable. Another cool thing, you can mix it 50-50. Half product, half water. So that affordability goes twice as far. So I'm a big fan of the product here. Another tool I'm going to use a really high quality microfiber towel. That's important. We want the towels to do the job we want them, want them to do. We don't want to struggle with our tools. So it's real simple. When we want to clean the steering wheel, all we want to do is hold the rag outside the car so we're not over spraying all over the place. Add just a couple shots to the front of the towel. We're not trying to super saturate it, just wet it a little bit. Now we'll wipe it on the wheel. In these high use areas, like up around the top, maybe a couple of passes to get all the grime and oils off. Continue around the entire steering wheel, making sure we hit those thumb wheels also. Now you'll see the product just slowly disappear right off the wheel. Man, it's super easy to use. That took like 15 seconds and I'll tell you what, we can keep this wheel looking awesome. That's the whole goal. Keep our car looking new and feeling new. When we hop in here, we want to be like, man, this car is brand new. <laughs> And all you have to do is these simple steps. All right, so if you like these kind of videos, hit subscribe down here, turn on the bell, and you won't miss any of our future videos. And I'll tell you, boy, we sure like our subscribers. The list is growing. We're stoked about it. So also hit that like button. That tells YouTube you like the video, and it shares it with other people so that they get to see it too. Of course, both of those things are free, and we super appreciate you hitting them. Also, if you have any questions about anything I've done or anything in my garage, I love talking about cars, garages, trying to help people the best I can. Go ahead and leave that down in the comments below, and I'll get back to you as quick as I possibly can. With that being said, we'll see you on the next one. Yeah! Man, this thing's fun to drive. I think I might have to just take it out for a rip right now. Maybe go down to Waimea, rip around the beach. That's the thing to do. We'll see you guys later. Yeah.